and tonight we are here at the Gold Strike Casino in Tunica and we just tried our luck and we're doing all right not, you know, so uh, we are actually on our way to a mystery place, a place that my mom won't tell me where we're going, but it's supposed to be all historical and stuff. So let's uh, let's check that out. Next clip. Alright, so we didn't end up where we thought we were going to end up. We ended up at a place called the Blue and White. Um, the other place that Mom was thinking of had blue in the name, so we took Google Maps to the place with blue in the name that we could think of. And so, you know what? We're just going to eat here now. Let's, uh, let's adventure. As I mentioned before, we are at the Blue and White uh, restaurant, and the reason it's called Blue and White is because it, it's an old pure oil uh, gas station, pure oil being the brand name. So that's kind of cool. It even kind of has that old, like, that, that feeling of an old gas station if you look at it. That's kind of cool. All right, let's go. Tonight's, I wish I would have done a better job. I have done a horrible, horrible job of keeping you up to date on our food situation. I had some uh, some spicy or hot wings and a bowl of chili. Now the wings, uh, the wings, okay, so they weren't super duper spicy, but you ever get that kind of spice in wings or food where when you inhale too close to the food, it's almost like a really light pepper spray or mace. That's kind of what this was like. I mean, it wasn't horribly bad, but it made you think it was gonna be bad. Um, so I kind of enjoyed my food. It wasn't like five star awesome food, but I would say it was definitely worth what we paid and kind of enjoyable. Now, I'm, I'm gonna turn the camera here in a second and let mom tell you what hers was. Uh, but before I do, I'd like to remind you that uh, we're, we're here in uh, Tunica, Mississippi, the Tunica-ish, long story, for my mom's birthday. So if you want to help her celebrate her birthday, link in the description to her channel. Go subscribe. She does stuff a couple times a year, but she'd appreciate it. Okay, so I ordered fried chicken with fried green tomatoes and mashed potatoes and gravy. And it came to me an ice cream scooper of mashed potatoes in a bowl covered in brown gravy, which I still find odd because that's how they've served mashed potatoes in every cafeteria and every school I've been in since kindergarten. Now, mind you, I'm 50 today. That was a long time ago. But anyway, so I had the, the mashed potatoes and gravy were out of a box. I'm sure the mashed potatoes were out of a box and the gravy was no doubt jarred gravy. Skip that. The fried green tomatoes I had never had. Now, it's a big thing in the Southeast in the USA, fried green tomatoes. Basically, they were green tomatoes and they were fried. There was no seasonings, no seasonings in the batter. Well, there's two kinds of batter. There's flour batter and cornmeal batter. And cornmeal is real big in the South on fish and all that. So, and not chicken, but fish especially and things like that. So, it was cornmeal batter. So, basically, I don't think I tried real fried green tomatoes. But anyway, the chicken was okay. It was good, but it was completely bland. Void of salt, pepper, garlic, any of those flavors, but it was fried well. So I guess I have to give it 2.5 out of five stars. Anyway, um, that was good. But our breakfast this morning, I don't think anything can compare to that, except maybe the dinner that Anthony and I conned the, uh, it wasn't quite the pit supervisor, but it was one of the people who worked behind the blackjack counters. We conned them into giving us each a dinner buffet. So in about four or five hours, we get to go downstairs and eat another round of some of the best food you can get on a buffet. The 
pit bosses who work behind the blackjack dealer. And mind you, the players are on the outside of this pit. That's why it's called a pit. And pit bosses is why they're called pit bosses. But we con them into buying us dinner like we had just, we had sat there for hours. But like we had lost all the money we sat there for hours. And I think we're both up money. So no, we didn't lose anything. But they can't track that if you're a blackjack dealer and you've done that before. At any rate, I hope that you enjoyed this video and maybe we'll do a better job of showing you what a wonderful dinner we have tonight. And I'd like to thank you very much for joining us on this vlog. Uh, hopefully we'll do a couple more on some other restaurants in this area. We've got a big one tomorrow at lunch. Ooh. We're gonna do- Don't tell them, don't tell we're them. We're gonna do uh, one of the restaurants I've been to once or twice before. Anthony's never been there. So I can't wait to see his reaction to that. It's an award-winning national barbecue company. So, mm. well, till next time, don't forget to like, subscribe, and do all those things that make us lower jumps. Also, be awesome to yourself and amazing to each other. Also, if you've been to this restaurant or anything, every other restaurants in this area, please sound off in the comments down below because we're trying to build something so that when people go traveling to these areas, that they can kind of check and go, hey, these things are recommended. Bye. Bye, family. Thank you so much for watching today's vlog. If you'd like to watch more content, that's on screen now. Also, if you'd like to support this channel, you can find a Patreon link at the lower right-hand corner of your screen. Next vlog.